Welcome back to Dishing It. We are making a skillet Cajun spiced fish with tomatoes, and honestly, it was quite easy to do. It, I'm Wasn't surprised it? how easy it was. Yeah, yeah. And, and I think that you got all the flavors with the, the Creole sauce back mm -hmm. here, so it's gonna be good. Curious, what would you, let's say you're making this at home, what would you think would be a good side dish to accompany Oh, this? I thought about that. I don't I know, did. I was trying um, to think. Rice. Oh, rice would be yeah, good. rice would be good. Mm -hmm. I was trying to think of something. I yeah. don't, like, what would you, maybe a steamed veggie? Maybe a veggie would be good, yeah. Um, I don't know. I did think about it, and I thought, oh well, uh, what would go with that? I think probably rice would be my pick. Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, potatoes would be good. Potatoes are good with everything. Everything. Honestly. I was thinking my grandmother's staple at every meal mm -hmm. is you had to have certain things. Yeah. You always had like a salad. Always oh, a salad. Oh, yes. Always a salad. That's the first thing. You have to have the salad. Do you have to eat it in order? Yeah. You okay. have the salad. That makes sense. Then you have to have the main with two sides and bread. <laughs> a main, so like the chicken, mashed potatoes and green beans. Yeah. And a roll or And then dessert. Bread. And then dessert. That's right. Now do, every now, Sunday. Excuse me. Does that come with a drink? Uh, iced tea, preferably in my grandmother's case, unsweetened. Okay, that is great. Tea. You know, uh, when they had like um, Piccadilly here a long time ago, I would always go and order the fish, and then with two sides, and guess what they were? Fried okra. No. Oh, mashed potatoes. And green beans. Yes. Oh, like really? <laughs> and yeah. and spicy cornbread. Mm. Mm. That sounds we should. We've never made spicy cornbread. You could dip the cornbread in the sauce. Cornbread would be good with this. Yeah, cornbread. Yes, that would be amazing. The other thing I love to do. Did you ever mix your corn and your potatoes together, mashed potatoes? Oh, I think I have. That was. Yeah, that's good. That is so good. Uh, oh. Do we want to read some comments too? Yeah, let's tell? read some. Sure. Because we still have a few more minutes left to cook, of the of uh, the. I almost called it chicken. Oh well, you know. Uh, the other one. Almost a chicken. Uh, so the, I think some of these are definitely done. We put some of these in later, and we'll. But they're thinner, so we'll let those. See, now I always get confused. Oh, look too, at Cal. that! Don't you think I should flip that? Flip it. Flip it. Oh, oh it's, it fell apart. Well, it fell apart, so that must well, be. Well, that's okay. Away. That's all right. Okay. It's looking. Pretty. I always get confused because you know how sometimes you can eat sushi that's raw. Oh, I know. I get confused on which fish you can eat raw, and which you can't. I know. The mercury levels, I don't know. Uh, oh, oh, I, I, yeah, I don't know either. Who knows? Okay. Okay, we'll start at the bottom yes. with Alisa Cordova. Beautiful name, by the way. Mm -hmm. Looks delicious. I love seafood. Going to have to try this one. Well, yeah, definitely. We'll definitely post this recipe. Yeah, we will. Uh, Danetta Finney. Looks good. By the way, I'm at the gate with my homemade cinnamon rolls for dessert. Oh, ah! let her in. Let her in. Let her in, please. That's one of my favorite things. I know. They, I, we actually got word that she really wasn't there, but I believed her for a second. So and did you put pecans on them? Because I love that so much. That would be so Thank good. you, Danetta. But Danetta, if you ever surprise us, we will let you in. We'll, we'll eat them. Especially if you have cinnamon rolls. <laughs> uh, Carrie Knowles oh, said, yeah. we love mahi-mahi because -mahi yeah. it's good, good. I added that part. It is good, good. Uh, cooked on the black stone topped with sautéed rotella, garlic, and butter mixture. Mm -hmm. That sounds amazing. Yeah, it does sound amazing. I want that butter mixture. I like butter. Oh, love it. Now, that would have been something different. Not Instead of you use olive oil, to use butter in this. That would have been good. It's butter is always better. Garlic butter. Oh, yeah. That's Man, Michelle. Yeah. Uh, Lagina Dawn Marriott said, looks good. May have to try it. Yeah. Well, if we like it, you should. You'll know by our ratings how we feel about it. Yeah, it's getting close. It's getting it. close. We, we are about 12 minutes. It's officially in at 10 minutes right now. For, oh, 10 minutes. Okay. 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes. All right. Uh, let's see. Janetta Hardy said, I like country fried fish and grilled fish, but fish with tomatoes doesn't appeal to me. Okay, gotcha. I it's hear okay. You. I hear her. Well, no, it's good. It's, I'm curious to see, because you said all, the only seasoning we added was the well, creole. Well, yeah, and, and it, like I say, it's very salty, so we didn't need to add extra salt, and then it's got a spice to it as well. And I mean, one whole tablespoon sounded like kind of a lot, but we will find out. It, what if, you know me, you sometimes like to add salt, I may add more creole. Well, it's very salty. Did you try it by itself? No, I have not yet. Okay. Oh, I added it to salad last week, uh -huh. and it's very tasty, but a little goes a long way. A little of the Creole? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, Jeremy, do you think, do you think we can, uh, here's one thing. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and add this, because okay. we're not going to disturb them anymore. So on the picture, it looked like there was a little bit of something green. So I'm going to go ahead and, it may be cilantro, but we have parsley. We kind of have parsley. There we go. Oh, there we go. It's coming out. We just wanted something green to top it a little bit, just so it looks more like the picture. All right. 
I love it. What do you think? Yeah. Looks beautiful. It's pretty. Let's just leave it there cooking and do a side by side maybe. Yeah, let's whenever do that. we whenever you would like to put that up because I think it looks I beautiful. think we I think it's very close. Except yeah. we yeah. have more liquid. Yeah. I was then, just gonna say the, the fish in theirs is more present on top. Yeah, that's right. But Oh they, yeah. But they have stagers, food stagers that stage that. For yeah, shots. they probably took some of that liquid out so the fish would stand out more. Yeah. Okay. But I don't I don't see it being uh, Bad. Okay. Well, no. if you think it's I, I think it. I think let's try it. All right. I'm gonna give you this nice fleshy piece right here, and how about some sauce? Oh, I definitely want sauce. Yeah. And you know what? Honestly, when I saw this, I was like, should I? I didn't know it was gonna be that liquid. Get a spoon, or should yeah. we do a fork? So uh, we've got forks, Jeremy. So, I wonder if you could put sour cream on top of this. Well, I I think we could, and I think just I wish we had some. I just, I just kind of thought of that. That would be delicious. Come here, little fish. Don't get away from me. Mm-hmm. Oh, I just found Nemo. Yeah. Oh, you <laughs> hey, are you a fisherman? I know you're not. I'm really not. No. Have you ever been? Mm -mm -mm. Is it hot? Temperature-wise hot, yeah. Yeah. With my grandpa, I used to go fishing. You used to yeah. go fishing with your... Mm -hmm. Did you ever catch a fish? Yeah, many you times. Did? Yeah. And then we'd have a fish fry that night. My dad fishes uh, a little bit. He, he wasn't an avid fisherman, but he would. Um, I've never really fished that much. I, I, I don't like the cleaning of The real fishermen are not going to like what I'm about to say. Uh oh. oh. But sometimes my grandpa, because we were young and we went to catch fish, mm -hmm. we would go to like a stocked pond. Oh. Stocked. Because he wanted to. You know what that's like? That's like me buying a tomato plant with tomatoes already on it. Mm. That's exactly what I was thinking. Were you thinking that? That's serious. Okay, now this that's fish serious. is done and this fish is really good. I am tasting that Cajun though. It is very. Do you think it's spicy? The flavor, I don't think it needs anything else. I was thinking, oh, I might have to add this or add that, but that flavor is perfect. Ah. It's hot temperature-wise. I would like to add a little bit more of the tomatoes, though. I like that. Okay, get. You get know how our, our yeah. viewer said, oh, I don't know about tomatoes. I yeah, like you it. You really like it. Can I, I be like honest? It. Yeah. Um, I mean, it is plenty salty because of that uh, Cajun spice. Oh. Um, um, it is plenty salty. I like the flavor. I think I would have used just a little bit less. Less what? Just up the Cajun spice. Oh, see, Just I a think it's bit. perfect. Mm. But the fish is delicious. I like the texture of it. It's light. Mm -hmm. It's flaky. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. And easy. Guys, really, this is easy, and it's really delicious. So what you could do is go to the price cutter yeah. back at the counter where they sell the fish and the meats. Yeah. Get, like, four of those. Yeah. Cut them. I mean, that was super duper easy. Right. And if it you had was. the chop shop cut everything for you, you just dump it all in. So easy. Now, this one called for Cajun spice. We used our Creole, all right? Mm -hmm. You could do whatever you wanted. If you liked Old Bay. Ooh, you fun could, idea. You could do that. You know what I'm saying? Do you want to rate it, Kel? Yeah, I'm going to rate it. Okay. okay, let's look at Kaylee. Let's get a good All right, here we go. All right, hold on. I'm going to get a fish. You ready? Okay, yeah. All right, this is a 10, guys. This is a 10. I love it. Thank you. Thank you, Kelly. <laughs> Uh, I also am giving this a 10 because I did not know what to expect. And the flavor of the flakiness of the fish and the Cajun mm. and the veggies, mm. delish. It is so good. Love it. Wish we had time to eat the whole pan. I may eat you in the commercial. Okay. Uh, guys, guess what? Till next time, we're dishing it! Now I can eat the whole pan. Oh, it's so good. Mm. Yep.